Copper tubing fittings have been the preferred method for plumbing and piping systems for decades. Now with new joining methods and materials available, it is even easier to install reliable copper systems. Hi, I'm Dale Powell. And I am Harold Moret. We are project managers and piping application specialists for the Copper Development Association. Today we'll show you some of the new developments in copper pipe joining that will help reduce the amount of time it takes you to create strong, sustainable, functioning joints in HVAC and refrigeration systems. Soldering and bracing have long been the most common method for making leak-free, reliable joints for heating, cooling, and refrigerating equipment and systems. While the process for making these joints is basically the same, different filler metals and temperatures are used. This variation results in different pressures and temperature rating, making each joint suitable for specific applications. With demonstrating the proper techniques in fabricating high quality solder and brace joints in several of our previous how to videos. You can find links to these videos in the description box below. Recently, no flame technologies for joining copper tube and fittings have emerged. These press connect fitting systems reduce installation time while still providing proven, leak free joints at pressures and temperatures experienced in normal building services. Just like soldered and brazed joints, the materials and processes used to make these types of joints require specific pressure and temperature ratings, which dictate where they can be used. For example, one of the newest press connect systems is specifically designed for HVAC systems operating at pressures up to 700 PSI and temperatures up to 250 degrees Fahrenheit. This is well within the pressure and temperature range of most new refrigerants commonly used for air conditioning applications. A partial list of refrigerants approved for use with HVAC press connect fittings is shown. Installers must refer to the fitting manufacturer's literature to confirm compatibility. Now we'll walk you through the complete joining process of the pressed joint from start to finish. Measure the tube accurately to ensure it sockets completely to the base of the fitting cup. Cut the tubing square, perpendicular to the run of the tube, using an appropriate tube cutter. The end of the tube may be deformed when cutting soft or annealed copper due to its malleable characteristics. To ensure the best possible connection, re-round the tube using an appropriate resizing tool. This will reduce the possibility of damaging the O-ring gasket. Spurs must be removed from the ID and OD of the cut tube end. Depth of insertion must be marked on the tube prior to inserting the tube into the fitting. Marking the depth of insertion prior to pressing will ensure the tube remains socketed to the proper depth within the fitting after the pressing of the joint. Select the proper size of the appropriate pressing jaw and insert it into the pressing tool. Ensure the tube is completely inserted to the fitting stop, which is the appropriate depth, and squared with the fitting prior to applying the pressing jaws onto the fitting. Place the pressing jaw over the bead on the fitting and ensure the tool and jaws are at a 90 degree angle or perpendicular to the center line of the tube. Depress the pressing tool trigger to begin the pressing cycle. When the pressing cycle is complete, release the pressing jaw and visually inspect the joint to ensure the tube has remained fully inserted 
as evidenced by the visible insertion mark. The crimp locations must be checked with the Go No Go gauge. In the following video clip, you will see a maximum pressure burst test conducted with a standard brazed HVAC copper joint, an HVAC pressed connect joint in annealed copper tube, and an HVAC pressed connect joint in hard drawn copper tube. As you have clearly seen, copper tube and fittings can easily be joined in many ways for HVAC piping applications. No other piping material can be joined using so many varied methods and can handle as much pressure. And copper is truly the most versatile piping material. A step-by-step -step guide of the joining process can also be found in the Copper Tube Handbook under the Press Connect Joints for HVACR Applications section.